Hello everyone. Well, as you know that the Council for the ICSE Board has released a specimen question paper which is solved for semester 2 examinations which are to be held in this year in the month of March and April. So based on that specimen question paper, Goyal Brothers Prakashan have released a set of 12 different books in different subjects. This is the book for chemistry, a question bank with model test papers. Now let me tell you, this book is based as per the latest reduced and bifurcated syllabus for academic year 2021 and 22 for semester 2 examinations. Let me tell you the key points of this book. This book has chapter wise summary and question bank. It has the specimen question paper which is solved and released by the council for semester 2 examination. Also, this book has model test papers which are based on the latest specimen question paper released by CISCE. So now let us see how the book has been designed. To start with, let me tell you in the starting we have the complete syllabus. Please note that this syllabus is the reduced syllabus for academic year 2021 and 22. So in the starting of the book, the complete syllabus is given. You can see all the syllabus is given in the starting. After the complete syllabus, we have the bifurcated syllabus for semester 1 and semester 2. As we all know, both the semesters are for 40-40 marks each. So these are the bifurcated syllabus. We will be talking about semester 2 syllabus. After the bifurcated syllabus, we have the contents. The contents are divided into three different sections. Section A which is the question bank, Section B which is the specimen question paper and Section C which is the model test papers. Now this Section A has the units with the question bank, Section B is the specimen question paper, Section C are the unsolved model test papers which are five in number for the practice of the students. Let us see each section individually now. This is section A, question bank. This is unit 7, metallurgy, chapter 1, metallurgy. Well, if you note in the starting, we have the summary. All the summary is given point wise. The complete chapter has been summarized into short points only for the reason that the child can actually recapitulate the complete chapter in a very short while. So these are the points, the summary is there. You can see all the summaries there, even the chemical formulas are there. After the summary, we have the question bank. This question bank has different kind of questions, one marks type, two mark type questions and three mark type questions. Let me tell you, this question bank is very rich in questions. The important questions from the previous years are included in this. Plus, we have the questions are actually based on the latest specimen question paper. So this question bank is really, really uh, rich in questions. So here we have the multiple choice type questions. You can see there are almost 20 multiple choice type questions and the answers are given here after the multiple choice type questions. After that, we have again one word type questions and the answers are given again here for the one, more, one word type questions. Again, we have objective questions which are the fill in the blanks and there are almost 13 fill in the blanks and the answers are provided the same way. After that, we again have a similar pattern questions, state one relevant reason and all the answers are provided along with the questions. Now we come to two marks type questions. Earlier we were reading one mark type questions and you must have seen we had variety of objective type of questions. Now two mark type of questions are there, the answers are followed, the questions are followed with the answers. After the, this we have three marks type questions. Now these are all three marks type questions provided with the answers. You can see it is a solved question bank, all the answers are provided. You can see all this. Now, this is how each and every unit is planned. The summary is there and then the question bank is there. 
after that we come to the section b part of the book which is specimen question paper as you all know this is a solved paper released by cisce for semester 2 examination for this year so this is the specimen question paper this is a solved paper so this is the specimen question paper after this we come to the last part of the book which is section c which is the model test papers the model test papers are the unsolved papers for the practice of the students and let me also tell you these model test papers are based on the latest specimen question paper released by cisce for this term so this is the model test papers in a similar manner we have almost five model test papers for the students to practice so this is the model test papers the answers to the multiple choice type questions are provided at the end of each model test paper if you want to visit the website you can visit the website and find more question banks and more model test papers there the website is www.goyal-books.com thank you so much Now subscribe to Bright Duty course at rupees 1 per day only. Download Bright Duty app from Play Store and get the online courses prepared by competent and experienced teachers for different education boards of classes 6 to 10. Bright Duty courses are available for the subjects of math, science, social science, English and Hindi in English and Hindi medium. Bright Duty follows three step approach that is learning assessment and exam preparation in learning topic wise video lectures with explanation of concepts and discussion of textbook examples and questions are available with the solutions in assessment topic wise online mcq test practice assignments and chapter wise question bank are available with the solutions in exam preparation previous years question papers sample papers and model test papers are available with the solutions sign up today on bright duty and avail your courses at affordable prices